Yes, welcome to the Jamaica Young Police Channel. To our loyal viewers, subscribers and Patreon members. At the channel, we are a group of law-abiding citizens who believe in the rule of law and respect the rights of every citizen. But not the ones who do not subscribe to such behavior. We do believe in and support preemptive strikes because they save lives. This is a logical conclusion because preemptive strikes save lives and prevent the further loss of lives. We are all about saving lives at this channel. We at the channel aid criminals with a passion and do not want them over here. We do not want your views, your subscriptions, your likes or your comments. Please go elsewhere where the red carpet is waiting for you. Over here, we want you to go to prison or the departure lounge at Madden. Moving on to today's video. Yeah, so, you know, welcome to, you know, part two. This is the final part, you know, um, giving you the series about um, the court system, you know, um, you know, those who are telling you that the, um, you know, Jamaica must get rid of the Privy Council. I will tell you that thing, eh? the United Privy Council. Anyone who will tell you that about forget rid of the United Kingdom Privy Council and Parla Lowering, yeah, the Director of Public Prosecution, that has straight PMP criminal organization talking points. And we say that without any apologies because one thing you can get, you, you sure forget over here, you know. Is a real mama papa truth. You know, I get nothing else. When I lie to you, when I scam you, and when I can you. Because we have been there and done that. Yeah, we are in we were an investigator, a detective, so we know how the judicial system works. And it's corrupt. You saw you saw and read what happened with um during the black man case. Remember Chief Justice Brian Legosyx, you know, was about to let a black man in. It's because of bloggers, you know, shaming the Chief Justice and the PMP criminal organization you know, because he was hell, hell bent on releasing the money. You, know. you don't know you know, them see money in you know, the PMP criminal organization. You, know. you understand? The Peter Phillips and the other them I said, boy, you can't make it look so bad. You understand? We have to just, you have to just work with it, work with the system. Cause he was just like how him like the King Value Gang and everything. You know. Cause he never see a PMP criminal who him never love you tell them Remember this is the man, you know. A Chief Justice, you know, when never happened yet in the history of Jamaica, you know, out on the campaign trail, you know, campaigning for criminals and the PMP criminal organization. I tell the, the, the legislator them say, boy, um giving the criminal them tough sentence and our sentence don't work. Really? So how oh, in our eight is it work? How oh, in our eight is it work? You know, so say the man I benefit, the man I benefit from he might corrupt corruption big time. As you know, the, the ordinary Jamaican people will tell you. So, we just want your people to work with truth over emotion. So, this is the final, this is part two at the end. As we tell you already, you know, over here on an entertainment channel. You understand? So, today we want to emphasize the importance of choosing truth over emotions. Because most people, you know, don't use truth, you know. When we say most people, we are talking, so, yeah. They may like fear the truth. You say something about somebody with them, like them vex and all of that. Yeah. You see, anytime we as a people, black, white, yellow, green, purple, blue or whatever, gay, straight, yeah, you know, some people don't like hear the truth. Because they want to tell us, boy, hey, boy, you can't marry to a house. We are telling us that's a madness. Because we are going to do the house. You can't love your house. That's madness, that. Yeah, we're not going to tell you that. That's a lie. You understand? So, as we tell you all them things, eh, we, always, we will always tell you the truth. You understand? So anyone who is telling you, say we need to get rid of you, it's because they are on the PMP criminal organization payroll. And forget rid of Paula Lowellin. Paula Lowellin is not the judge. His judge is the one who controls the courtroom. Is the judge is the one after where the where the, ju where the juror was arrested and charged. Is the judge supposed to make sure that all T's are crossed and I all I's are dotted? Not the director of public prosecution when they come on to the jurors. Because the judge know that already and them thing they say, at the time, you cannot use less than 11 jurors them. So the defense middle with the case with Vibes Cartel, you understand? So nobody watch because you hear people are lick out on Vibes Cartel and this and that. They are not going to lick out on Isaac Buchanan because Isaac Buchanan is a PMP criminal organization supporter. And they won't tell us that Isaac Buchanan should not be in the court. I practice law because he is a convicted court dealer. Reason why? 
Because them can't, them can't offend, them can't offend them handlers. Isaac Buchanan should not be in any court. So right now, they might bring down the Jamaica, you know, they might bring down the level of ethics in a Jamaica, morals, decency, honesty and truthful. Show me an honest criminal. And they might do it. You understand? So, moving on. So we often, we as a people here, yeah, we often let our emotions clothe our judgment and influence our decisions. That's why we at the Jamaica Young Police and we always tell people, you know, it is crucial to remember that emotions can be, f be fleeting while the truth is constant. So, you know, say emotions go up and down and the truth, the move. If you know about when they talk about constant, they talk about maths, right? That's what you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, maths. I saw it go, yeah, constant. You understand? You have to understand. You know, we are talking about the, you know, the various, the, the, um, the various um, maps and data or the, or, or it's set up on them thing. You, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, it show you, you know, or, 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 or you know, in you know, the, the map, if it's constant, you understand what I'm saying? Or the graph, the graph, I should say, with the maps, if it's constant or it varies. The truth is constant, it can't move. But you flee your emotion, it go up and down. This minute you're happy, this minute you're sad. I just saw it go on and thing. It truth no move, it truth does constant. So that we work with. We don't work with emotion. So by, by prioritizing facts and reality over feelings, we can make more informed decisions, informed choices that benefits our future. We must base our decisions on logics and reason rather than temporary emotion, emotional impulses. And that's how people are play upon only emotional impulses and they know they no found in it. Guess what? They know what they're doing. They know they're saying, oh, because, remember, you know, them say, you know, you understand, them say, remember, you know, what them say, you know, say, the sheep follow the shepherd, you know, and most, most of the people, they are sheep, you know. Uh, just like with vibes, vibes cartel, uh, vibes cartel say to us, uh, boy, him are the shepherd, you know, and the people, they are sheep, you know. Anything when I tell them, I don't them I go work with. I just saw it go. Yeah. I'm saying on a week. And I, that, that is what is happening with most of you people. The shepherd is leading you guys because you're the sheep. So anything with the shepherd say it, you go work with. So that is what is happening. You know, you use your brain. You use emotion. Yeah. That's why over, over 8,000 now, you know, and subscribe for the channel. Boy, oh, for you said this, you know. Uh, boy, I, I, I said this about, about, about him. Or you said this about her. Or you said this about the PMP criminal organization. Or you said this about the GLP government. Uh, unsubscribe me, unsubscribe. Yeah. And uh, we lose the most subscribers. And guess what? We still not change. Because we don't uh, we, we, we not care about if one person listen to it. I understand some people are telling you a lie about. Um, yeah, people are telling you, oh, boy, we never tell you. A lie, they might tell one, you understand? Lie them, I tell her them thing. They at one time, them tell people about say, Oh, boy, I'm not doing no more video on them thing now unless I get a certain amount of subscribers. We don't do that with people. We don't tell people that. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, we tell people, say, Boy, yeah, in time a video reach a certain amount. Yeah, we, we tell you with, with the being a man video. So when, once it reaches 50,000, yeah, then we come out with it live and direct. Which, you understand? I just say, God, we don't lie to people on them thing. Now. I say, Boy, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you have met, but most people now have good memories still doing you know, it because. As them say, the Adam say man say thing, I say most people attention to one is like a goldfish. I saw some of them say. So the next time you're faced with a difficult decision, take a step back and consider the facts before letting the emotions take over. Remember the truth will always lead you in the right direction. Remember that you know. The truth is the truth and nothing but the truth. And if you are this far, in you know um, listening to us at the Jamaica Young Police Channel, and you haven't subscribed to the channel, yeah. Consider subscribing, yeah. Subscribe and hit the notification bell and select all so that whenever we at the Jamaica Young Police Center release a video, you'll be the first. Yeah, you'll be one of the first to receive the same. If you're having problem in time we release a video, you're not getting um, the video from YouTube. You have to unsubscribe and subscribe again. That's how it goes sometimes, you understand? We have no control over that. So when people are saying, I say, boy, I'm a supporter, oh, boy, oh, you release all them, I want to get the notification. You have to unsubscribe and subscribe. I just saw it go. You understand? As we say, we don't have no control over what YouTube doing. YouTube do what they want to do and them things. YouTube can promote a channel and them can hold back a channel. I just saw it go. And them control it. I feel them system, I feel them, feel them platform and we just work with it. You understand? We know say, some of the things that we say YouTube never like it because you don't know. You know. They're my part of the walk to this. Clan, yeah. 
up is down and down, you understand what I'm saying? So, we, you don't know where I real mama papa shoot, so you understand? Yeah, remember to share the video. Yeah, man, share the video with a friend, your girlfriend, your boyfriend, mama papa. Yeah, man, because mama papa shoot me again. Your ex, your, yeah, your co worker, your neighbor, your side chick or your side man, and tell a friend to tell a friend about the Jamaica Young Police Channel. That we over here, we're totally different. We are not beholden into any political party. You understand whether the PMP criminal organization or the Jamaica Labour government. We just all about real mama papa truth. But yet, look, we don't support criminals in no farm. Nowhere. You understand? And we just want Jamaica from these 63 people. You understand? We know who are the real criminals. You understand? So if you not understand, you know, if you, if you, if you live in a, the same community them that I am from, you know, and you now nah, use education for come out and you feel say picking up a gun or become a dan I got help you. I two yeah, yeah, remember you know, I two two destinations you look at you know, departure long or prison. Just remember that. I'm going to a left out of my age group, out of, from my, from me at Jonestown and Jungle. Two. Just remember, me and and Orius, Dinah Brown, from Love Street. Two. Everybody dead. Everybody dead under uh, me pen or dove cut. Dead. Dead, dead, dead. Two. So if you don't want to follow General Stark and all these guys, just continue. Because this will never end up. Whilst, we, uh, whilst you uh, uh, will follow my part, read, 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 and you understand I'm the well in the school. Yeah, then we have all of the, all of the girls, them, and you understand I'm living in a nice community. Them. I live in a house where there's no burglar bar. I never live in a house. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, I just saw it go. So, yeah, as we tell you, so give the video a thumbs up. Yeah, thumbs up. You, you know, give the video a thumbs up. Because we know that you you know you're gonna like the information that you know that we're sharing with you. Because a fox, yeah, with us I read Mama Papa Chot. You understand? Uh, join the Patreon squad, yeah. It's right there in you know, the description box. And if you feel generous, like you, hey, if you want to donate or give the Jamaica, yeah, we have things down there. We have people, we have um no, we have people, we have Zell, we have um cash up, yeah, kind of people them ask it. Because some people feel yeah, feel generous and say, yeah, you know, well, we like what you're doing, you know, um, support at the Jamaica Young Police Channel. Yeah, this, that, and one and two little things. Because, hey, look, between me and as long as we have life, you know, we can talk and we still have we faculty. And that's what I'm going to do, you know, because we just want about Jamaica. We don't want Jamaica to become 80. You have some people, it's what's in it for me. Although they might tell about privy council, you know, which part of them, them live amongst white people. Yeah. But we're not going to tell you which part of Europe they live to, and people we are promoting that. They live amongst the same white people, them, you know. yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So don't listen to them. Don't let your emotion and don't be misled. You understand? You can join the Patreon squad. When you join the Patreon squad, you'll be able to watch video that cannot be shown on YouTube due to YouTube rules, regulations, and laws that govern them platform. Yeah, some people, oh, you chat too much. But for information, I key. Knowledge is power, so we have to share it with you. You understand? When you go to um, join the Patreon, right, the link is inside. You know. Once you join, you be for know who kill Rifle. You see them, yeah, you see them name, face, and everything. Rifle, who kill um, Douglas Chambers, and a whole host of other things that you you know that we couldn't we couldn't post to YouTube due to the graphic graffiti and all kind of things. You understand? And we have a reason why some things we keep on Patreon. I just saw it go. You understand? And some of my Patreon videos are too long, you'll be able to see it on Vimeo. Look, we have to pay for all of them things here. You know? And look here, we just make it a six ninety nine. We don't try to forget, we don't want to forget rich. We don't want to tear on them things that say you have to pay this, that, that. No, we don't have that. Because we don't have this profit. We don't have this, we don't have this with heart, mind and soul. You understand, sir? You watch, you listen, and you decide. Yeah, man, I just saw it go here at the Jamaica Young Police Channel. Or the PMP criminal organization payroll. The PMP criminal organization then try to them try to recruit us, tell them us how much money, and then tell us who are who they on them payroll. We are not one of them, we are not a member of them payroll. So that's why for them people them can't like we. Because we are going always tell you the real mama papa truth. You understand? Yeah. If you notice, you know, um who they, anybody where them not like them attack on them. Anybody where them get talking um them 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 people say, hey, if you, you understand, like how you see them go off of Philip Powell, because Philip Powell and, uh, uh, and, 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 and Gummy Beer, and uh, Mark, Mark Gummy Beer Golden, yeah, them, so that's why Gummy Beer, yeah, well, so anything where Gummy Beer give them in, I hate them all working in, I just saw it going, you know, yeah, Mark Gummy Beer Golden, 
You understand? So anything where gummy beer give them, I, them are work with, yeah. So that's why them go off a, a Philip Paulwell car. A, a, a gummy beer, they remember say, a gummy beer, they rub um, Paulwell the theme thing, you know. But boy, we never got to touch on Philip Paulwell, but come here and tell us uh, some dangerous things happen on them things. So, yeah, so we continue the journey. Yeah, I just saw it go. You understand? So now listen to the, don't listen to the cynics, them. Them now, with zero judicially, them now have no experience in the court system. Them was not officer of the court. You understand? So they need, they, they need to understand how the court operates. Reading and experience are different. So not because a man can't read and articulate. That's the same thing when they tell you about, you know, about yeah, how people read and they tell you this and they have no experience. When they don't have none either, they have no experience in this, in this kind of discipline. But they tell you because they read. They never arrest nobody. They never arrest anybody. They never go to court to testify. They know if you collect a statement, they know what the, the, the various rules and various rules, regulation that you know that, um, operate in a court and the law. They don't do that. So not because a guy can't read or a girl can't read or them things. You have to have somebody who have the experience. You understand? I have been there and done that for, dec for over a decade. You understand? As a detective. So yeah, I was a detective with over a decade of experience. I've seen corruption from the bench. From buying into the scam and get rid of the UK Privy Council. Critics don't know the judicial process works. Don't believe their misinformation. So you know say them apart a part of criminal organization. Any person I tell you about we get rid of the Privy Council, they are part of the criminal organization. Any person I tell you get rid of the Privy Council. Remember, you know, they are the same one I tell you about Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes corrupt, you know. Who put Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes here, the PMP criminal organization, Dr. Peter Phillips, let me remind you. Just go back and look, man, and turn them lock down the court for one day and tell the Prime Minister, say, if you don't give up Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes, we are going to lock down this to Andrew Olness when he's Prime Minister, when he just uh, um, won election as Prime Minister. If Andrew Olness was like a Edward Siaga, he would say, all right, fine, we don't want to lock down the court. Yeah, all of them they marching, uh, just tell them, say, all right, continue, lock down the court and just use some young people who are patriots and put them, turn them in a judge. And all of them would have gone home without no pension. I saw see how they do it, but hey, not look now. Him now, he might try to, boy, he might try to be partisan and, and try to, um, yeah, he might try to kiss up to, look here, in case you don't know what them thing, the PMP criminal organization, when you come on to these sense, they're not in a dot. So when you try that and I try to kiss up to them, them only say that as a sign of weakness. You have to stand up to them people. Yeah, yeah. me know them, you know. You understand? So, you know, you're na you're naive. Not because you, you understand what I'm saying. So, they need to understand how the court operate, man. You know, reading, as we tell you, reading and experience, total different. They, they are different. You understand? So, just refrain from buying into them about them. Get rid of um, Privy Council. Don't believe them misinformation. They are liar. PMP talking points, they are, they are, they are, they are uh, repeat. You understand? So, thanks for watching the video and, you know, subscribing to the channel is important and we said that already. You know, so, you have to understand, say, join, in, uh, join us in preserving integrity of our legal system and defending the Privy Council from those who seek to undermine it. Any person I tell you, say, the, you need to get rid of the, the Jamaica need to get rid of the Privy Council, that's a PMP talking points and getting rid of Paula Lowell PMP criminal organization talking points. People go back last year and turn them and extend Paula Lowell in and all of them out there. Bring my sass. Hey, hey, look here. I true, hey, they, they expect say, true, them know say, most people, Jamaican people, attention span are like five seconds. You understand? That's why them, them, them pray, them pray, them pray upon your ignorance, you know. So that's why them do that. So the thing is that now, um, in turn, the, the labor, them extend um, Paula Lowell in time on the bench. Yeah, in external time as the director of public prosecution, that, you know, you understand what I'm saying? And the PMP, them come out uh, with um, our Isaac, remember, you know, Isaac Buchanan, our uh, rear admiral guy, you know, they did have a program and them thing there. And I saw Isaac Buchanan, you know, I saw Isaac Buchanan, um, them bring him to the um, the GLC, you understand? And yeah, and them slap him with a two year thing. Isaac Buchanan should not even be there on, on a lawyer in Jamaica. But hey, you never hear them lick out upon that either, you know, and tell you, say, Isaac Buchanan not supposed to be in a, in a, in a, in a lawyer in a court because of criminal conviction. 
reason being, them, you have to understand you now when people get them talking points from them who them beholding to people, them can't say certain things. Because by saying certain things, you know, so you're going to fall off a payroll. You understand? So them can't tell you, say, hey, look, by having Isaac Buchanan as a judge, as a officer of the court, as a, con a twice convicted drug dealer, I reduce, I reduce the thing down to criminality. You have turned Jamaica into a criminal's paradise. That because a, a lawyer is supposed to have ethics, decency. He's not supposed to have no criminal conviction for dishonesty. Can you wish on, show me an honest criminal? You'll never hear them tell you that. Because Isaac Buchanan a PMP. Isaac Buchanan is a part of a PMP criminal organization. You know? Remember, say most of the human rights lawyer in a PMP criminal organization. You know? Until when he goes to boy, he might tell um, I, 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 I'm smart, you know. I use um, one of Vibes Cartel music according to him and the other guy, the other rear admiral guy who was <laughs> labor right and them and them kick him out. I know him a PMP. I don't know who would I trust him because I could never trust a man where he did a PMP and then it was PMP and then turned labor right or vice versa. No, if you're a labor right, you're still labor right. If you're a PMP, you're still labor right because you're supposed to have a core belief. If you don't have none, you don't have nothing about you. You're just all about what's in it for me. It's just like Dennis, Dennis Meadows, uh, you understand? Dennis Meadows and Ali Barrett, he's a criminal organization supporter. That's why the PMP gladly grab him, you understand? Yeah, so, you know, we're moving on. That's why we tell you, say, only not the most of you, and guess what? Only easy to get vexed, because I don't open your feelings. Yeah, feelings is meant to hurt. I truth, we are going to tell you. You will never hear them tell you, say, Isaac Buchanan should not be. No. Attorney at law in a court in a court system of Jamaica because a twice convicted drug dealer. Cause Isaac Buchanan is a PMP criminal organization activist and supporter. And because they are on the payroll of the PMP criminal, them can't say it. But we can't say it because we don't be holding to nobody. Or if you have a criminal, alright, imagine all the same judge that sent Isaac Buchanan at Jamaica asked for two years of prisoner for cook. Imagine having that man now. In front of your argue case, and you know, say you, you as a judge, I suppose all dirty boy, I'm saying all drug dealer boy, all mule, I'm saying go to prison, and him no, you understand, tarnish, tarnish the office of attorney at laws when lawyers supposed to have held a different standard. Now, me have a, a, a drug dealer who convicted for coke, now me have him in front of your argue case, him, not, him should have a prison. But you're not going to hear them tell you that because guess what? They're a part of a PMP criminal organization. So that's why they're tell you now to get rid of the United Kingdom Privy Council. Me, I tell you, say, no, no, forget rid of it. Because uh, we don't want the, any of we get rid of it. I done it done. 80. 80. You see what happened at 80? We're not far from that, you know. At this, at this little brother, when him, at this JLP brother, when him, Andrew Wallace, I hold up Jamaica little, you know. Any oh you know, them get to take it down, like, gone, gone, you know, because I saw a PMP strike drive, you know. Remember, say, 18 years, them dead, you know, for 18 year crime. Hey, I saw Jamaica become the murder capital of the world, you know. Now Jamaica, they are fifth. Yeah, not bad, but we shouldn't even dead us so. up. One time, when a team did in the top 10, when Edward Sayer got there, I want a peaceful place at Jamaica. At Jamaica, you know, at Jamaica, I helped destroy the other, with the influence of the other Caribbean island, you know. You understand? So, look, if we get rid of the Privy Council, does count on Jamaica be in the next 80? Gone, gone. Gone. Come here, I say, well, I tell you, I pay corrupt. Whether or not you want to believe it, you know. The whole of them, you know, all I lie, them, you know. I see them last school, and going in the Caribbean. You understand? In the, in the Caribbean. The same university, they go. Say, all of them, my friend. What do you think? Just like how you say, Bert Samuels and the others, them can go check Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes and the other lie, judge them for a weekend with bone people back. I see them thing we happen. You understand? We are telling that, and the hawks we are telling that. Look for all the big court case the other day, a man to go be. Right, we know you nobody talk about it, you know. A money that running out of the case with all the police, them, you know. Mishandling, mishandling the exhibit, you know. We know you nobody talk about it, you know. All them the detectives they from narcotics now get referred to them thing there. For mishandling the court case. Whole heap of coke, you know. Must be 60, um, 60 key of coke, you know. And the man get away, you know. Because the judge said, yeah, everything was set. You know, because when you come on to um, e exhibit, you know, it's a chain, chain of command, you know. You understand? So the chain, the exhibit supposed to go through a different, different chain, uh, chain of custody. Just like how you have a chain of command and them thing there, you understand? 
So it's supposed to go through uh, and once there's a missing missing part of the chain of command and you can't go a psyche and adapt them do call them collect money. I pay so you can see that if we get rid of the privy council you can count on Jamaica right to eat it. We are telling you that. We now ask you, we are telling you. So we continue so we just believe in preserving the integrity of our legal system. That I only little thing we kinda of hold, hold up. So together we can ensure that justice prevails and the rule of law is upheld. You understand? So the Privy Council is the highest court of appeal for Jamaica common law judicial system. It hears and makes recommendations to the sovereign, sovereign and resolving them. them. The Privy, Privy Council may recommend that the Court of Appeals judgment be confirmed, overturned or varied. You understand? So if you don't understand varied, boy, I have to go look that in the dictionary. We don't have everything we're going to tell you because time. Jamaica already participated in the Caribbean Court of Justice as the interpreter of the treaty that governs the Caribbean community. Some praise the Caribbean Court of Justice for the quality of its jurisprudence. However, there are some potential drawbacks to joining the Caribbean Court of Justice. So we are telling now, you know, that's why we are saying we now want Jamaica to go into the Caribbean Court of Justice. So you listen to this, you understand? So the men nobody come tell you about boy I try like them I try shame Jamaica. A PMP talking points I'm tell you. PMP criminal organization talking points. We don't look no friend from no guy or no girl. A guy go away. Cause once you repeat the PMP PMP criminal organization talking point, you know love Jamaica. Because you know so the PMP is the PMP strive for criminality. You understand? The only people <laughs> you understand what I'm saying, them strive for criminality. You understand? Yeah, we're not there to defend the vibes, cartel, and them things. No, I, I rule a lot of them things. What happened to them things with the, with the juror? That have to do with the judge. That now has nothing to do with the director of public prosecution. Every, all I talking points go right back to the PMP criminal organization against Paula Lowell and the PMP criminal organization. And that's how them are repeat. And we are debunk it and I say, I lie, them are tell. Lie, lie from the pits of hell, them are scam you. We're not going to beg to come out because I want to see you. Know. Yeah, <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? You know, yeah, as some people say, boy, Jamaican, Jamaican people love Duppy, you know, I just say, you know, yeah, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, we, yeah, man, we just tell the real mama papa tune. So we argue some drawback on them thing there. Lack of experience. The Caribbean Court of Justice is relatively new court and may have a different level of knowledge or expertise than the United Kingdom Privy Council. We don't say white man, them bright and the black man. We are saying black man them corrupt because they know one of the white people they don't know that nobody can take no brown paper bag or give the judge them in England. Because guess what? In England, for every light post and every pole there over there, yeah. Guess where them have? Camera. Yeah, man, them have camera. Everywhere you turn in England, you have camera. If you have, hey, look here. All if you have, I tell you, between me and you and them things there. If you ever go in one bubble at England and them things there, yeah, bubble. Yeah, that I wish for. Only for police working there, you have camera. You see, some people are doing some things in a public, and you say, wait. You understand? Them have bubble up in New York, too, and in a DC, and. Yeah, we're not going to talk about things there. Bubble or something where you have police in a real time. That's why they can't catch criminals and them things there. In a city, them. Bubble, because them can't. Yeah, just like how Jamaica have Jamaica eye. Yeah, I just saw it go. So, yeah, so political interference. There is, there is some concern that the Caribbean Court of Justice could be subject to political interference from Caribbean governments. Sound, sound right here? All right, that's why we're telling you so we don't want that. Because you know, so few black people and then corrupt. We don't, we don't pretend like, say, so. yeah, we don't, we don't pat no white man on the shoulder and say him no corrupt. We don't say him my heart of corruption. But we are saying right now, in a 2024, we can't get it over to them a black people who are so corrupt. We don't want 80. We don't want Jamaica to become 80. So if we see if Jamaica from become 80, yeah, we have to deal with the white man. I just saw you go, yeah. Make the white man see this. So who are going to tell you about, oh, boy, you like your child? No. A adult business, that's why we still, yeah, we still we have to still deal with them. Because them don't know them not hey, look here, them don't know vibes cartel. Them don't know vibes cartel, them don't know Sean Storm. Them don't know Paula Lowellin, all them know how them get the transcript where them get from the court and where you judge error. I judge fault, you know, is not the prosecutor. So when they might tell you about Paula Lowellin, a PMP criminal organization talking pints, people who open their eyes, go back and look who were against the appointment for them extend Paula Lowellin 
time to be the director of public prosecution. I PMP criminal organization, Gummy Beer Mark, yeah, Mark Gummy Beer. Gummy Beer Mark was totally against it. Him and the PMP criminal organization, and then you have a woman now, where they're there when you're in Catty Pike, one of eight police, and she love every criminal. So that's why Isaac Buchanan was um, lobbying for her to become the director of public prosecution because them know so once she be, she become the the, the 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 director of public prosecution yeah man um vibes cartel case good and she gonna slick it way yeah she gonna make it you understand what i'm saying because she gonna work say boy them tamper with the phone and we're gonna tell her who tamper with the phone too yeah the next video we'll tell her who tamper with the phone with vibes cartel case oh no i go shock yeah so we'll continue the journey so yeah so ultimately the decision of whether or not you know, to join the Caribbean Court of Justice is a political one that the Jamaican government must make. No, we know that. The ultimate decision, for, you know, whether or not to join the Caribbean Court of Justice is a political one. The, Jama the Jamaican government must You're still with the Privy Council, Mr. Wallace. We are telling that. Yeah. So this is it now. Lack of trust. Some Jamaican may not trust the Caribbean Court of Justice as impartial and independent. And we are one of them. Because we know, say, a pay criminal we have in our judicial system, like Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes. I will say it without any apologies. Anytime you have a judge, the first in the history of Jamaica, we have a Chief Justice out there campaign for laws against Jamaica. And that Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes out there you know, was doing, you know, campaigning against him 50 years, 50 years to life for people who are committing murder. I'm not going talking talk in points, I say, you know, he, 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 as a judge, you know. I said, boy, that's too much, you know, too much time, you know. So, for him, for him black life, you know, for him, him no value for him black life, you know. Because through him live with him, him claims that nobody not going to do him nothing. Until in time, him make a deal go bad. When time him get a brown paper bag, you understand, and something go wrong. And them say, no, he must be dead. I just saw it go. You understand? Yeah. And then people, can you know, see if they are, if, if anything I'm to Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes, the first thing, if they, if they kill him at Jamaica, even we are the Jamaica young police, and I say, boy, I wonder, full foot in Brock. Yes, because we know, say, yeah, we, uh, we don't come to that preconceived notion already. Say, Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes is corrupt. And the reason why we say that now is because of Vibes Cartel case. Anytime they see him, director of public prosecution, a fight, and I read all the evidence, I kind of tell him what the law say, and them thing, and I say, oh. And him say, you could have chat from now till next year. Anytime you don't chat, me not listen to nothing where I say, I'm not abide by in a law car, my court, and I'm in charge of it. And me, yeah. I mean, you get my paper bag already, and me have to do it. So that the case, and I me not go accept that as evidence. And them talk, and them talk, and them talk. And in legal sex, I say, I tell, I tell the DPP, say, I waste, I waste the time. Cause cartel and the rest of them, they go walk. So continue to chat. And until you sit down, down, the defense not even stand up because me are the defense and me are the judge. You understand? And then he say, hey, he tell vibes cartel, he say, boy, you're free to go, you know, cause we not accept the evidence. The, we want the witness them come here. Although I see PMP criminal organization when my government and them pass the evidence act, you know. You understand? But vice can't tell you. Money run. We are telling you. I just saw it go. So that's why we don't want the privy council. So when them are tell you that, so them want the privy council, so them want to get rid of it, a PMP talking points that, and all of them things go against everything that we want, we stand for in a Jamaica. The little peace will leave any oh we gone from the privy council. Right at 80 we gone to. We are telling you. You see what with 80? Yeah, you don't know say what? 80 have them own final court, you know. 80 have them own final court over there. We are telling you that. You understand? So, you know, we'll continue the journey. So each option has the potential benefits and drawback, and the government must weigh these carefully. So I can't uh, look here now, we are telling you, you know. This now, you know, we are telling you. So this now, yeah, this is a poll done by an independent, yeah, an independent poll say I can't a 2016 poll. Yeah, man. And it's a boy, yeah. Guess what now? And you know, it's a poll or something where people can't, you understand what I'm saying? And them say, uh, them say what? This is where Gle Gleena, you know? Gleena is a, a part of a PMP criminal organization. Here this now, no? according to a 2016 poll by the Jamaica Gleena, 53% of the Jamaicans supporting joining the Caribbean Court of Justice, while 38% oppose it. All right? The poll also found that 59% of Jamaicans believe that the Caribbean Justice of Justice will be more fair and impartial than the United Privy Council. Alright, look here now. Let me tell you something now. You see the reason why um, they might tell you that. Remember, you know, the United um, Privy Council 
if it was for United Privy Council, you know, Vibes Cartel wouldn't be. You know, can I get away you now? The judge them now go box in a retrial. Unless the judge them realize and come to her and say, uh, yeah, I'm tampering with the jury that now have nothing to do with the prosecution and defense that was doing it. So we send back the case to trial. That that would be good. But we know so that now go happen because they and I saw them working in England. We are telling that based on our experience as a detective, them now go do it like that. Them are gonna say, boy, here, he must be free because he spent this and that and all kind of thing. I saw them say, them say rather a hundred guilty man um, get away than one innocent man. I like them, I tell you. They don't say that about white people and the black people, they attack when they say that, when white people are telling that. You understand? So, yeah, moving on. So, you know, so the decision of whether or not you know, Jamaica should abandon the United Privy Council of the Caribbean Court of Justice is a complex one with various factors to consider. Each option has potential benefits and drawbacks, and drawbacks, and the government must weigh these carefully before deciding. Don't get get to need a privy council is a PMP criminal organization dream. Just remember that, you know. If you love PMP, if yeah, do you love the PMP criminal organization, murderers, extortionists, and baby killers in Jamaica? Get in need of the Privy Council, the United Kingdom Privy Council, is the PMP criminal organization dream. So all of those who are peddle such argu argument, they are peddle it for the PMP criminal organization. We are telling you that. The Privy Council is the highest court of appeal for many countries, including Jamaica. But to the PMP criminal organization, it is seen as an obstacle to their criminal activities. You understand? We are telling you that. So the PMP criminal organization, they believe that they can operate with even more impunity by removing the Privy Council. Imagine Al, Al, Al Silvera, Jailan Silvera right now. Anywhere we get rid of that, you don't know them are find something to let him go. Come remember saying no? You know, so Jailan Silvera is still a member of the PMP criminal organization. He's not upon a suspension or then kick him out of the party. And he's a murderer. He use him one gun, kill him wife. We don't talk about knowledge because the thing is there. The forensic. And he's still a member of the PMP. If a policeman charge him murder, he's the on suspension from the police force. He's still an active member in the party. See him here. And he's in jail for killing his wife. But we saw all address him to one of them things. So imagine a Jamaica where justice is perverted, where criminals run wild without fear of consequences. Remember, say 98% of the people are in a prison in Jamaica. You know, a data this, you know. They are from PMP criminal organization communities. What that tell you, say? Who are who of who are gear are like criminal? Who are produced them in a Jamaica? IPMP criminal organization, they are responsible for doing it. You understand? So we must stand against this destructive agenda. Anybody that telling you that forget with a privy council, I interest in Jamaica, a lie. I interest in PMP criminal organization. But we say, why the Prime Minister had something so hopefully, yeah, them can obliterate them the, the criminal organization in my poll and get yeah, obliterate them. Come on, obliterate them next time and keep obliterating them. Because if you want your son, you know, like all the 15-year-old Lamar Gray that a chicken back where you go kill crocs. If you want your son to become a criminal and a gunman, you know, you just align yourself with them. You know. A 2% two two of the prison population in Jamaica are labor right. So that means to say, if your son, if you live in a labor right community, or you have labor right um, philosophy and think towards them, your chance of your son going to prison it's two percent. Cause two percent of people in a prison are from GLP communities. Two percent, ninety-eight percent of people in a prison in Jamaica. Are PMP. Then when the address a PMP community, you are you are the B nine ninety-eight or the two percent. You are the latter. I just saw it go. I know me come from a ninety-eight percent. So people I say, oh, I escape. Yes, me escape. Cause me never did that in a jail. And I escape. I parenting. It's called parenting. You understand? So, yeah. Anyway, anyway, get with that man. Uh, you know, anyway, get with that. The United Co um, Kingdom Privy Council, I PMP dream that man becomes reality. So, speak out, resist, and protect the integrity of Jamaica's justice system. Keep the PMP dream from becoming a reality by eliminating the United Kingdom Privy Council. Do you see the cause and effect of Indicom Act? That the PMP criminal organization government, led by the most corrupt Prime Minister PJ Patterson, the black man, as on Jamaica's crime problem. Yes, we know Sir Bruce Golden signed it into law, but a PJ Patterson have it on the books of 1994. Most of them don't know how to read. Ask any police 
who used to read and them thing now go back even type in francis fab type in francis fab says this about indicom that was after renita adams had killed the people them up a crawl just type that because one of the things here yeah and on a bruce golden baby a pmp organization babies edward siaga the same man the most police who don't like a him edward siaga said we give jamaica indicom i done it all on the criminal or control the place because jamaicans are Inheritantly violent people and people who do not like to obey the law. They are very indisciplined. But yet still, I him uno eat in uno police in And when Siago was Prime Minister, guess what? Most police were involved in a fatal shooting a charge of murder because I lie the people they may not tell them uno. I tell them police, but I tell you that. I PMP come in with this tragedy of a charge of murder. But some owner decide to go to prison because I'm a fool. I tell you that. Yeah, how you mean? A them same one design a system for sending her a prisoner. No found her. What? Nothing to one like them. Me? Me is with the guy who love me. I saw it go. Me no with no guy who no like me. PMP no love police. So me no, me, you know, PMP criminal organization I love police. Them do everything. The amount of things where they do to police. But yeah, you see through them licky licky. Yeah. You, you understand what I'm saying? They don't care what kind of abuse them get. And what's in it for me? Me and not that. I know some of you work. Me no work that way. Me can't think. So, yeah, moving on. You understand? Yeah. So, any YouTube blogger that's promoting the separation from the UK, United Kingdom Privy Council, is promoting in the PMP criminal organization dreams. That is their talking points. Long time they want that. From PJ, I see her again, you know. See her again. Why we not, why, uh, we not get rid of the Privy Council? You understand? And become a republic. Thus, by becoming a republic, hello, you understand? By becoming a republic and then get rid of the Privy Council, you understand what I'm saying? If the Labour get rid of it, I know, I'm going to go 80. 80. Straight 80. You understand? I, I gang them. Right now, I gang them control the capital of Jamaica. You know? Same like Port au Prince. I know, you, I know you government at 80 control the capital. I gang them at 80 control Port au Prince. And I gang them control downtown Kingston. The poor police, them. Hey, you know, so what I all them town um, yesterday? Police. Lick down one, old, one boy near Mal Mal. You see, all corals of them come out and all the swarm them. And the police, them, they are so non -chalant. Them supposed to have fight. Them supposed to have pretty much, hey, when them come out, them supposed to have fire shot because the people, them, hey, look here. The way the criminal, them, is so beef, you know. They must shoot the police, them, right there after the boy and all them things, you know. Attack them, you know. So, make them stay there. I have to do all of it about that. We don't care stay there, you know. We don't matter who a guy a labor right We don't care who we don't like criminal. You understand? Mal Mal shoot that white police. I saw it go. Yeah, him get dirt. We support the police. We don't support criminal. No time. So we are telling ourselves, please do not let Jamaica get more corrupted. As it is with Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes. And we say that without any apologies. The best person to tell you to get rid of the Privy Council is someone who has intimate knowledge of the judicial system. Has been to courts on countless occasions. Has testified in court. And it's not some political activist or the PMP criminal organization. Don't be fooled. It is only going to destroy us as a people and bring down to 80's levels of corruption. Why? You think, you think 80 reach a point here because I see a black man, them, they corrupt and them corrupt over there. That's why 80 is like that. 80 final um, quote in our freedom quote. I most corrupted black people them in the Caribbean that are 80. We don't want nothing to do with them. Them too corrupt. And them, you know, remember, you understand? And them, I blame a white man. When everything is built on corruption there. The only little time, 18, yeah, I brother, I brother with the name Aristide. And I see him, black people get rid of him. See boy with the name Guy Philippe. That I boy will bring a much M16 rifle come to Jamaica. Aligned to the PMP criminal organization. And only there, you know, see a little bit of gun with um, Angola in a jungle the other day. And only there, you understand what I'm saying? Remember, you know, man. Hey, uh, remember, you know, you think, you don't think you're going to see the, uh, you think you're going to see quarter yet, most of you know? Just watch. You understand? As we tell you, so don't be fooled. It is, uh, don't be fooled by these people who are telling about, forget with that. Lie. Lie, they might tell. They might part of a PP, a criminal organization. So, are you a fan of YouTuber, blogger promoting separation of the, of the United Kingdom Privy Council? You think again? What they are doing is supporting the dream of the PMP criminal organization and we at the Jamaica Young Police are telling you that 
lie them I tell you because them, them was in police them don't know nothing about the justice system I know corrupt all the judge them there they may have, they may have no case but if you try I enter you as a detective come out of court and drive off then, then change it for me, uh, change the trial date when you are foreign them don't know that because they are not police you understand adopt them a ghost we are not ghosts we are tell you <laughs> you understand what I'm saying anything when we tell you a truth a real mama papa truth we know, we know hey look here we say it already and we say it again. We are the only YouTubers. Only YouTubers. We lose the most subscri um, subscribers because we talk the truth. People don't like for you hear that. We no business. We no there. We no there for big no friend. As we say, one for all, one for, you understand? If we are fight crime, one person alone can't fight crime. You, know? you, not, you can't win. You need a team. But some people, some people, it's what's in it for me. I just saw it go. Corruption. So when they pretend to say them against corruption, I lie them, I tell you. Because they know, say, yeah, they, guess what? They know, say, you're a fool, you know. They, they know, say, you're a fool. And they know, say, yeah, boy, you love them or you like them. And anybody say nothing about them, you go vex. Because you can't think either. But yet, say, you know, they might insult other people and say, boy, oh, boy, them IQ low and them thing there. Your IQ low too. Because, see, me, you are probably like the, them, like the people that they are criticized. But you don't know that. You don't even know say them are insult your intelligence because them they, they were telling you say Chief Justice Brian Legacy is corrupt in a black man case. Then then them see him and I tell you say, oh boy, you need to forget three that privy council. You know see the confusion there. Ah, why? You can't think. Me never got a big school, you know, St. Mary's College, me go. The same school where one of the richest men of Jamaica, um, Butch Stewart, attend. Yeah. Me never got a big school. I just saw it go. So the best person, yeah, yeah, yeah. so as we tell you. The best person for one here about the Privy Council are somebody, somebody who has been into court numerous times, testify, and is not a political activist, or so the PMP criminal organization, or the Jamaica Labour Party government. Don't be deceived. Separating from the United Kingdom Privy Council will only bring down the level of, will only bring do us down to the level of corruption seen in Haiti. Protect Jamaica. Say no to separating from the Privy Council, United Kingdom Privy Council. That's how we are. Think twice, man, before supporting the PNP criminal organization's dream for Jamaica. Chief Justice Brian Legacy already brought corruption to the country's judiciary. We see it. Remember, you, know, you understand what I'm saying? We don't have to go back there. We have done videos about that. The only way to protect Jamaica from further decay is by keeping. The United Kingdom Privy Council oversight. As someone with first and experience in the judicial system, I urge you not to be misled by political activists. Separating from the United Kingdom Privy Council will only lead us down the path of corruption seen in Haiti. Safeguarding Jamaica's futures, let's not allow the PMP criminal organization to ruin our country by listening to these. PMP political activists who are PMP criminal organization activists on YouTube pretending that they are for justice when they are for corruption because they will benefit financially. Remember, uh, I just remember, remember who were on the front line when the PMP criminal organization, I tell you, say, 50 years is too much for murderers to life, uh, 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 50 years to life for murderers. Them, they weren't there because Mark Golden was out there peddling, say that are too much years, and Dana Scott Motley in the Senate. Just remember that. Them never, they, they, they were never on that, they were never on that um, wagon or that train. They were, they, they were just observing and saying nothing because they have to repeat what, they, repeat what them handlers tell them. Them now going to tell you that. When we are telling you, say, no man, oh. You take a life, a life, your life. Them not nah tell you that. But you don't remember. You understand? You don't remember. I just saw it go. You don't remember. And anybody with anybody with Mark Gold in them in a PMP organization, PMP criminal organization against, them ride with it. That's why them ride against Philip Paulwell. You understand? That's it, you know. Because them have to, and they didn't get them talking points. Out. Remember them try to recruit you. But we said, no, we never know that. You can't be bought. But here yeah, now, how we you not like because we tell them the truth, because we can't be bought. They're not going to tell you that they are on anybody payroll. No, because they don't want to be seen as tainted. We know they're not going to pay a 
no guy. Them try to recruit me. And we say, no, we none of that. We can't be bought. You understand? So I just saw it go. As we tell you already, say, some individual and, and some organization to remove the Privy Council as the country final court of appeal, Chief Justice Brian Legosax and other corrupt judges at the Jamaican judiciary have raised serious doubts about the justice system integrity. One glaring example is when Chief Justice Brian Legosax refused to allow witness statements in the murder case involving Vibes Cartel and others citing that the witnesses were either dead or missing. So this blatant corruption calls into question the credibility of the Jamaican legal system. The ideas of allowing individuals like Superintendent Ari Bungus Daly, SSP, James Sobs, Danai Williams, Kurt, Kern Spencer and others to have the final say in the legal matter is alarming. I remember, you know, I just saw it go on them thing. I, I see him, I see him, our oh, corrupt system, let <laughs> go them people there. Yeah, well, I tell you, you understand? So the level of corruption in the Caribbean, particularly among black officials, is troubling. Reality that cannot be ignored. It is crucial to critically evaluate the intention of those advocating for removing the Privy Council as Jamaica's last court of appeal. The consequences of entrusting corrupt Individuals with such significant power, judicial power are dire and have far-reaching implications for Jamaica, Jamaica's legal system. Let's not look the other way. Ignore or disregard the harsh reality of Jamaica's judicial corruption and potential dangers of allowing corrupt, corrupt individuals to dictate the course of justice. Join us in uncovering the truth about Jamaica's judicial corruption and the urgent need for accountability and integrity in the legal system. The trial judge's decisions to continue a case with 10 jurors despite one being arrested for trying to bribe the four person that are in a case with five cartel. Yeah man, and the same, the same person who are peddling the PMP criminal talking points, many are quick to blame the director of public prosecution, Paula Llewellyn, that a PMP criminal organization talking point that again but the truth is that the ultimate authority lies with the judge, not the prosecutor. It is important to remember that those pointing fingers at the judicial process may need a clearer understanding of how the court operates. Experience and knowledge in the legal system are crucial before forming opinion and criticizing the decision made by judges. With extensive experience as a detective, yeah man, you know, Sir Porter shed light on the corruption that can, that can occur within the judicial system. It is imperative not to fall for the misinformation spread by cynics and critics with, no, with little or no experience in the judicial process. So, oh, if you go listen to a, a guy or a girl, we never lock up somebody, never collect a statement, don't know the system, and I tell them, boy, ooh, um, watch, watch them in front of a white man and this and that. Look, man. If I never them, we reach 80 long time. We rather a white man them, yeah. Because I feel we black people them corrupt to the core. And we say that we don't only apology from top to bottom. We system corrupt. We're not ready for we not ready for being no adult yet. Yeah, if we become a republic, all that all nonsense. Cause what the does to Jamaica. If you say, oh yeah, independent. Independent what? Independent when you still have your beg. I see them people them were, were colonized here, yeah, them still yeah, at them control the money system. Who make them rich? Who make them rich? Who give them the money? After God name, after, after God name, um, give nobody no money and them things. You know, them same one create the money system. Them can't make, they, them same one, they same white people, them, you know, them control the money system in the world. You know. Them can't say, all right, right off all of that, we are going to this amount of money for everybody can live just like we in Europe. And they don't want that. Because them enjoy, if you see black people suffer, other people, Spanish people to suffer, and the people them in Asia, them control the money system. If they make every country, and them control the money system, you know, so if they want an equal play fee. You understand? All right. Say, all right, look, this is where everybody is going to start. So everybody, you understand, once you have a certain job and this and that, you're, you're entitled to certain things. They're not going to do that. Because they want you to continue to suffer and make you feel like, say, boy, oh, at them, them, at them, who, who make them rich? At them, all them do is enslave and enslave other people, rob them, them thing, thief them, thief them, thief and copyright. I, they're my biggest thief. But yet still in the same breath. Well, we have to trust them no more, we trust our own people. Because our people superior when they come on to corruption. 
Because man know man, man can drive go check man for a Sunday. Boy, hey, you get a case, you know. Yeah, ask Bert Samuels, you get a case, you know. To Chief Justice Brian Lego Sykes, yeah. Uh, you know, say, yeah, and yeah, uh, them know, you know, say, witness them dead or the witness them now come, yeah. Boy, I have a case with Cartel, uh, yeah, you know, you know, yeah, with um, Cartel. And the witness, them, them now come a court and them thing, yeah, and, and them don't testify already, yeah, prelim, and you understand, and the prosecution, I go on for use the statement, them. guess what? We don't want to enter it, you know, because you don't know, am I, am I a client and them thing, yeah. so here, you know, just name a number and them thing, yeah, and you understand what I'm saying, but nobody that be told, you know, you understand, because I'm going to charge him five mil still doing you know, for represent him, that's why I come talk to you, because I ain't good at them thing, yeah, and them laugh, <laughs> yeah, true, all right. So yeah, just tell me. I'm saying, alright, yeah, you say five. Yeah, alright, me, you say like how oh, are you come to me and them thing there. Just give me six. And then him charge, vibes cart in thirteen. So him get seven and the judge get six. I just saw it go. Yeah. We just like tell you all them thing they work. You understand? Yeah. So we you know, so we we tell you that and them thing there, so yeah. So it is imperative not to fall for the misinformation spread by cynics and critics with little or no experience in the judicial process. Don't let yourself be fooled by, take, by, by the talking points of the PMP criminal organization supporter and activist pretending, pretending to be for justice. They are not. Therefore, the, it's what's in it for me. PMP talking points, everything. The getting rid of Privy Council, getting rid of Paul Alwin, PMP criminal organization talking points. I don't for use on the end. We don't be willing to know guy now, we don't beg friend. We don't care and subscribe because we don't, uh, what we say on them things. Because so honest here, we don't care. We don't dare for, we don't dare for, for lotion. We don't, uh, uh, um, as them say, <laughs> keep it and say, boy, woman, me lotion, me no lotion, man. Woman, me powder, me no powder, man. I just saw it go. We don't powder, we don't pick no powder, nobody. We don't, you understand? The way just tell you as it is. You understand? So don't be fooled. Understanding the complexity of the judicial process requires more than just reading about it. It's necessitated first and experience and expertise. So you don't know, so we have that experience. That's why we are telling that. So before you buy into the notion of eliminating the United Kingdom Privy Council, consider the insights shared in this video and make an informed decision based on facts, not hearsay, not by PMP criminal organization talking points. And we see when you gobble it up, you know. Yeah, man, I can't say honestly. When you gobble it up, they lie them. So remember the truth about the judicial, produce, um, judicial process is far more nuanced than critics may lead you to believe. So I just saw it go. So don't buy into the lies or the liars them. A PMP criminal talking points them gain you. Scam them a scam man. Can you know? Have yourself a beautiful day. Jamaica, Young Police Channel. And this is the end of part two. Jamaica, Young Police Channel, out. You know, we have come to the end of, yeah, we have come to the end of part two, yes. You understand, in, you know, telling you that um, anyone telling you about getting rid of the, um, the, the Privy Council, the United Kingdom Privy Council, is the PMP criminal organization dream. It's that's their, their talking point, and forget with Paul Llewellyn. So if you have a good memory, you'll realize that last year, um, last year when the extension of Paul Llewellyn, remember who was the crying or who was um, calling her all kind of names and batting for Katy Pike. It was the PMP criminal organization. Isaac Buchanan always even said, you will never hear them say anything bad about Isaac Buchanan, but say him should not be practiced. Like I'm a convicted criminal. Them cannot offend PMP criminal organization supporters. Can't tell them the truth. You understand? Yeah, we are telling that. I just say it. Go. But we, we are telling the real mama papa truth. We don't support forget with our PP, um, the Privy Council because that's our last last stand when they come on to justice because our people them is so corrupted. So as we tell you already say, in conclusion, it's truth over emotions. Where we prioritize truth over emotion. This is not your typical entertainment channel. You know. Instead, our goal is to educate, inform and inspire you to be the best version of yourself. We want to empower you to make well-informed decisions about your future without being swayed by emotional attachment to people or things. So we are all about self-improvement and truth-seeking. Let's prioritize facts and knowledge over fleeting emotions. Just remember that. So I just saw it go. So thanks for being a part of our community dedicating to personal growth and enlightenment. 
before we tell you a lie at the Jamaica Young Police Center, we shut them out. We're not going to mislead you because we want the best. When we say we want the best to the Jamaican people and the best for our country where we were born. Have yourself a beautiful day. Jamaica Young Police Channel, out.